just a little video I'm doing. I got to Crossland Church. I went to, uh, I think it was Eccleston Church earlier. I found a few Hodge graves. This is um, Crossland Church. I thought I'd put the video on just to capture the um, the bells, to be quite honest. This is Sarah, this is Croston Church. I think they chimed, could have been six times. There's lots of these huge slabs as well, everywhere. There is a cemetery which I'm going to go to in a minute. But look at all these. Look, there's a grave there, RT 1667. These are very old. Eccleston, that's where I went earlier, yeah. Yeah, these flagstones are enormous, aren't they? And these are quite good as well, these carved wooden figureheads. Must have some, somebody must have done those. Well, there's a little nature reserve. It's called um, Bishop Allen, the Bishop of Allen Chester's Wood. <coughs> so I might have to come back another day because um, there's too much to do. This is a little walk, you see. I might have to come and do this on a separate occasion. Visitors welcome. I'll just do a little bit of it. They've got. There's gravestones in, in here. I mean, look at that one. It's been made into a table, look. This one here. In, even that's made into a chair. Somebody jump. There is a, there is a name called jump. Obviously, this is a children's adventure park as well. So, uh, this is something I could do another time. Can hear lots of dogs like Brandy today. So there's um, Croxton Church. I've only been there a few hours and I've already on my second church. That's called Leaping Salmon in memory of somebody called J.H. Nixon. Somebody's been doing some pruning. You can smell the garlic though. The wild garlic. No dogs that... It looks like there's a lot to do here. There's a Croxton, Croxton Heritage Trail. I am here. Let's see you can do this, this trail as well. I'd do that later. I wouldn't do that today because... Um, Welcome to the Croxton Heritage Trail. It's been set up to preserve the historic buildings, events and life of Croxton for the next generation. The actual walk takes in many of the village's unique and historical monuments. The main highlights of the walk are Town Bridge, Church Street, the church, the old church and Croston Hall. Please follow the clog symbol shown top right hand corner round the trail. That. I'm not going to do that today. I'm not going to do that today. I'm just going to go see if I can find the cemetery. I think I'll come back. I should have to park my car. <laughs> Crosses on the bins that... Yes, I will do it. Look, there's um, gravestones everywhere you go here. 
I'm looking for a a hodge, a how. Um, I can't remember all the names. I got the list in my pocket. This is just a small video I'm doing. Sacred to the memory of Alice, the wife of John Hayes of Croston, who departed this life June 30th, 1839, age 48. And he died in 1843, age 54. Yeah, I don't think, I don't know if the church is open, but it might be open in the daytime. Of course, it is Easter. But there is, I'll just show you this beautiful view, which I've got. <coughs> Everyone takes photographs of this particular view. It's an old part of Croston, full of history. It'll be part of the Heritage Trail with the old cross down the bottom of the road and the old smithy as well down through there look old little cottages all the way down there the church won't, I bet you anything it's not open I don't even know if this is the door, I don't think it is no there's more slabs here look at those slabs everywhere, it might we might find somebody in a minute. There's a Harrison. There is somebody who's married to a Harrison, but I can't remember who. God, there's so much to do. This is a really good find, though. I'd love to come back. There's a Dickinson. There is somebody married a Woody. There is a Dickinson in the family, actually as well. This person died in 1810. Right, I'm going to turn off for a minute. I want to take some photos. So, 